introduction yourself. Uh, my name's Adam Hans. Uh, I own B First Scaffolding Limited in Nottingham. Um, I set Callum Hancock on uh, as a scaffolder. Uh, got to know him, found uh, that, that he was a boxer. I've always had an interest in boxing. Um, I used to box for the EBF, I won the Midlands title three times. I was looking at going pro back then in my life, but then scaffolding sort of took over. Um, and I got invited over on the training camp uh, to, to train and help bring him along a little bit and I sort of got the bug back, so yeah. I'm not sure what I'm going to do yet. That, that was my next question, you know, is it, now you've got the bug back, is it something that you kind of want to possibly maybe take up yeah, a bit? Yeah, possibly, and... yeah. I could either sign up with Ryan yeah. um, or not commit so much and go back on the EBF circuit. Yeah. But I've had a few shoulder injuries, I've just had some recent results that I've got arthritis uh, oh, in the okay. shoulders, but I'm sort of like working around it and now work's like a bit more established, I've got a bit more time to train yeah. um, and just, just pick it up like that really. This is the first time you've been over to Lentory? I've been training. over uh, um, with my girlfriend Alicia and, the, and our kids, uh, just on a holiday but not, not, not training now. What's uh, what's uh, Ryan like as a trainer? Brilliant, yeah. great, great bloke all round, good trainer. Uh, so, uh, yeah. So just, just going back a little bit into your boxing, how did you kind of get into it? I started when I was eight. My dad got me into. Uh, well, he said I used to ask to box. Yeah. Uh, did the amateur circuit, boxed for Trinity, Ilkeston, yeah. Bradford Boys, um, Milbury Boxing Club. I was the first ever registered Ooh. amateur boxer for that club. Um, and then I went on to the EBF circuit with John Ashton. Yeah. Um, he was de decent, got some decent fights, uh, and I won seven, seven and oh. Really? So I won every fight as an adult. Um, and then, like I said, I set the scaffolding company up and uh, had to decide. Put one or the other, pretty much. One or the other, really, yeah. I suppose, in a way, jobs like long term, isn't it? Boxing, you don't know kind yeah. of what happens, a bit of a chance. No, but, yeah, um, so because that was up and running and starting to do. Uh, well, I, I made the decision to stick with the scaffolding over the boxing as well. If it was the other way around, yeah. and I wasn't doing anything at that point in my life, I'd have definitely gone boxing. So, you know, do, again, do you think it's it's one of them things that I don't want to say you'll regret, but if you if you don't maybe do that one pro fight, is yeah, it something you may yeah, possibly, kind of? Yeah, it's sort of playing on my mind a little bit, and everybody who sees me box uh, say, why aren't you pro? Why aren't you pro? Yeah. They don't realise what's involved. And the commitment yeah, that's involved with it. And all the and he says, and stuff, yeah. he says that I'd be the one that got away if I didn't. So yeah. it is playing on my mind, yeah. Oh, well, listen, you know, hopefully, you know, maybe you'd see you in that one profile. But thanks for giving us a little bit of time. Do you want to shout out uh, again your social media for your company? And what yeah, it's uh, B First Scaffolding Limited, and um, we're based in Nottingham. Uh, we cover lots of areas really, but um, we're very professional, very safe. Um, and we're a decent team, so if you'd like to check us out, be first scaffolding limited, uh, Nottingham, um, we can uh, cater for any of your scaffolding needs. Cool. Nice one, thank you very thank much. You. Cheers, Cheers, buddy.